Hey everybody, this is Lorelia. Um, so today I want to do a video and I'm going to caution you. This, this video is probably going to make a few people mad. And uh, the reason why it's probably going to make a few people mad is because um, today is supposed to be, or should I say tonight, is supposed to be the biggest, um, the biggest night in television history. And um, if you don't know what I mean, um, there is a show um, on TV uh, called Empire. Um, so you pretty much have to be under a rock. Whether you watch the show or not, um, there has been so much talk about it on TV, on the radio, on social media. So with that being said, um, I will not be watching the show. Um, I have not watched the show uh, for the whole season. And before, you know, I know, you know, some Empire fans out there are going to be mad. Um, this is not the bash the show. I'm not doing a video because of that. I'm not going to bash the show. I actually like uh, some of the starring um, actors in it. Um, Taraji um, Henson, um, that's somebody that I've always been a fan of since, you know, she did that movie Baby Boy. And, you know, there's Terrence Howard, always been a fan of his show. But the reason why I was never interested in watching the show this season is because there are some things that I am personally working on. And with me having a life of being a homeschool mom, um, along with trying to run a business, my, my day and my window um, of work is very small. So, um, yeah, I probably could make time to watch the show if I really wanted, but it wasn't that important for me. Because what I'm currently working on now is more important than watching someone else build their own empire. So, so what, what am I, you know, what's the point of the video? Um, yesterday, um, like I said, um, I was listening to, uh, I was listening to, um, normally don't listen to the radio. Um, I usually listen to things, um, MP3s or audios on my cell phone. But for some reason, radio was on, and there was a popular radio host. If you're from the New York City area, I'm not going to call no names, but let me just say her first name starts with Angie. So with that being said, uh, Taraji was on the show. Now, was she there in person? Not sure. But there was an interview taking place, and there was something, um, and I listened to, I, I listened to the interview as, mu as long as I was in the car. And, and Taraji talked about, and like I said, let me warn you, this is going to be a long video. Uh, Taraji talked about how as long as she's been acting, it was not until she got this role where she is now, you know, I guess, you know, in so many words, um, a star, you know, and, and at least, it, you know, everything is relative in her right. And, you know, she made some comparisons to very, you know, large mega stars in terms of what they go through. And, um, and, and she went, you know, also went through a scenario about how, you know, um, before she did this role as her being named, you know, I, her I guess stage name in the show is Cookie. Before she took this role on, there were things that she can do just like a normal person because I guess people just didn't recognize her out in the public. And she talked about how she could go shopping. She can go to different parts of, you know, neighborhoods and, and nobody would really, you know, like make a big, ah, oh, you know. So she said... Now is the first time since she's taken this role where now she needs, you know, she needs bodyguards or she can't go certain places without people recognizing who she is. Now, with that, with that being said, like I said, this is not to take away from the show of who she is. Very happy for her. I mean, uh, but in the bigger scheme of things, like I said, the reason why I don't watch the show is because there are things that I am currently working on. The same way that she is working on things, and by no means am I trying to compare myself to her or anyone of that magnitude, but what I do understand about life is that when you are so um, uh, concentrated or focused on something you don't have time for things that will not serve you. And the reason why I know that is so, because there was a time in my life where, you know, uh, going back to what I said before about this tonight being the biggest night in, in television history, 
they did comparisons to who shot JR. Um, when Tony Soprano got shot on The Sopranos or when the show went off the air. I mean, all these television shows or cable shows that have, you know, grown a large following or that was very popular, they are comparing the show Empire to this. And what does that and what what does all that mean? Going back to what I said, there was a time in my life where I was one of those TV watchers too. And if someone said they were not watching a particular show, I almost looked at them like they were strange. Like people would look at you. I mean, you literally tell someone that you do not watch Empire. They're going to look at you with two heads. Like, how do you not watch this TV show? But like I said, that, that's a whole nother story. Um, so, but now, since I'm so focused on what I'm working towards and my window of when I have time to do things at night, I'm not going to dedicate a Wednesday to watching the show. Now, yes, I do, you know, agree that in life and during the course of the day, you need to unwind. But watching Empire is not it. <laughs> you know, that, that's not what I want to do. But going forward with what I, the point that I want to make with this video, and like I said, I know this is a long video because we're already at the six minute mark. Pay attention. Many people are not paying attention what's around them. And the reason why is that if they are paying attention, they're paying attention to the wrong things. And there are so many people, like I said, they're paying attention, but they're paying attention to the wrong things. And if you're at a place in life, and, and I, like I said, I see it a lot on social media. And you're sharing, um, sharing posts of, you know, fan pages or, or celebrities or whatever it is that floats your boat. If you don't know how to get paid, and that's right, how to get paid, how to get a piece of the income of you doing all that you're doing, by being on a, you know, Facebook or whatever social media of choice you, you enjoy being on, then you're missing the boat. See, that's why I said the conversations you're listening to are the wrong conversations. The people that you pay attention to are the wrong people you're paying attention to. Going back to Empire. But before I go there, I just want to say this also. Right now, there's someone who's watching this video. Somebody may have already cut it off because, like I said, it's long-winded. And also, I'm talking about the show that everyone loves. But if you've lasted at the eight-minute mark, which is where I'm at now, there's somebody watching this video. I don't care what it is that you love to do. If you love to bake cakes, if you love to um, make you know, baby doll clothes, if, if you know how to crochet, if you know how to write books, whatever it is that you like to do, and you don't know how to leverage social media or your activities on the internet to get a check, you're listening to the wrong people. Your circles of who you listen because like I said, people are paying attention, but they're paying attention to the wrong things. And by no means, this is not to convince you to pay attention to me or to pay attention to what I'm doing. But what I will say, step outside your comfort zone because I'm going to share this with you. Now I'm going to go to Empire. There's someone right now who understands everything I'm saying. They understand social media, they understand internet marketing, and they understand how to get money and how to get paid doing it. And right now, they are at their computer. They may have created a Facebook fan page, fans that love the TV show Empire, fans who love Taraji Henson, fans who love Terrence Howard, and they know how to monetize it. They get it. They understand the power of them being, um, uh, doing social media. They understand that there's people like you who don't get it. And they know that they can leverage all that activity that you're doing, talking about the show, sharing posts, but they're going to get a check. 
And like I said, pay attention. <laughs> pay attention. Because people just don't get it. You know, I was watching a video. That same Dame Dash video that has been spread all over the internet. Like it or love it. If you can get, you know, if you can get, you know, past, you know, some of the curse words allowed talking. There was a point that Damon Dash made. And he said, the direct communication between consumers and what you want to sell is so easy now with the internet and social media. And if you don't know how to use it to your advantage, then of course, like he said, you know, you're not going to understand how to be a boss. Because I've heard this a few years ago. The gatekeepers are gone. Like there's no, there's no excuses on what you can and what you cannot do. The thing is, is that so many people are listening to the wrong people. And like I said, it's not to convince you to look at what I'm doing, but this is to convince you to start paying attention to some of the things that go on around you. I'm going to let this be my last point. A few years ago, the TV show, very popular show, I wasn't an uh, avid watcher of it, but I knew it existed, called The Game. Uh, started on regular TV, then it went on BET. And then BET canceled the show. Do you know what brought the show back? Let me share with you what brought the show back. There was a girl who was a very big fan of the show. And what she created was a Facebook fan page all about bringing back the game. And how so many people love the show. With her making such a loud noise on the internet. She got the attention of some of the producers who decided to bring the game back on to BET. Like I said, pay attention. Things are not just automatically happening. I'm going to give you a second example. The TV show Dallas. If you are a fan of the show, you know that that show ended sometime in the late 80s, early 90s. I was a big Dallas fan. I remember that. What brought Dallas back when it came back, what was it, two years ago? Larry Hagman was basically, I, I mean, you know, he, he was, you know it, it was almost at his last breath. But he was able to come back to the show when they brought it back. Do you know what brought back that show? It was social media. It was the internet. There were people out there who loved the show. Who caught the attention of some networks. Where they were able to say. Okay. We can actually revive this show back. So what is the point? No I'm not watching the show. Empire. <laughs> no I'm not watching it. But what I will say is I'm working on doing things myself. And see, a few years ago, when I had a setback in my life and in my business, I started to pay attention. And I started to pay attention to what some people are doing. Because in life, there are people who know more than you. And if they know more to, than you, they're making more money than you, you need to pay attention. Now... Right now, like I said, I'm already at 14 minutes, about to go into 15, and I don't want to make this video no any longer. If you love your life, you love what you're doing, you know, what you're doing is it's okay with you, and you know, and you ain't trying to do nothing different, then maybe this message is not for you. But for that person who's like, I'm interested in learning more. You know, I, I do want to step outside of listening to those who, um, or should I, let me just scratch that. For the person who's like, you know what, I want to learn something different. Start to pay attention. So like I said, this is LaRoy, I'm already at 15 minutes. Sorry to make this a long video. Um, 
you know, connect with me. Um, depending on where you're seeing this, inbox me. There may be a link below. There may be a link above. And, um, you know, like I said, start to pay attention. So um, to those who are watching Empire, have a great time tonight.